Today we're going to be talking about the Legend of Korra characters and how gay they are. First and foremost, we have Korra. I'm just going to be blank here. She's obviously a butch lesbian. 10 out of 10. Have you seen this girl fight? Like, I would not want to fight this girl, okay? Okay, this one can be quite surprising, right? Because you're like, oh, he's so strong. He's so simple. But have you ever wondered, are you bisexual? If you have... I'd say 8 out of 10 bisexual right here. This one, Loki, I feel like is kind of obvious. I feel like she's lipstick lesbian. I mean, look at that lipstick. <laughs> Super cool. Great fighter, but like lipstick lesbian, 10 out of 10. This one throws you off, right? Because all the girls are like, oh, he's so hot. Look at that. Okay, scarves, first of all, gay. Okay, the outfit, the collar, gay. 10 out of 10. Okay, you're gay. You're the gayest on the show. Babe, my body really hurts. I'm on my period. Oh, baby. Do you want me to go to the store and like get you ice cream and chips and stuff? Yeah, maybe. Wait, period? But I thought you were going through menopause. <laughs> no. <laughs> Is that why you haven't been in the mood lately? No. What are you talking about? Hold on, let me check. What are you doing? I'm gonna check your privates. Stop! No, let's look. No. you're hiding. Girl, how'd you know? Huh. Who has a bigger butt? Who has better vision? Who's a better driver? Who farts more? Who was the first one to have a crush on the other? Who's a better kisser? <laughs> <laughs> Who flirts the most? Who's smarter? Who's more clumsy? Who talks the loudest? Who has a better laugh? Who gives better presents? Who has better hair? Who is more stubborn? 2021, the boys are taking crop tops from the girls. I don't care if you got a six pack or a dad bod, you fucking rock that shit, King. Hiya! PSA for the straight boys and anyone else that it applies to because you're probably nasty as well. So, when you're washing your butt, make sure you slide a finger up there, doesn't matter which one, for maximum cleanliness. It's the gays for me, it's the gays for me. Do you see them out here loving freely? Straight well, not. Public service announcement. I check all of my notifications, every last one, and if I find you attractive, I will spam your page. So if you see my face ten times in your notifications, that means I think you're cute. Hit me up. Should you re-download Grindr? Lose 20 pounds by summer. Rain on me. Love boyfriend. Hate boy. Rain on me. Sean Mendes Camilla Cabello's beard. Rain, Rain on me. Vodka soda yum. Hoppers. You have better eyebrows than any other top in the USA. Still fat though, ha ha. Bitch, you would never believe what just happened in Walmart. So there was this lady, we're not going to discuss her race, even though we know what it is. So there was this lady, she was making a big fuss, she didn't want to wear her face mask inside, she had a disability, she had a broken leg, she had a broken pussy, daka, 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 like the whole nine yards. So she made a big fuss, a whole scene, so there was this 
other crazy ass hoe that walks up to her and starts spraying the Bath and Body Works warm as a peach spray all over this bitch's face. She then goes, bitch, I bet you wish you would have been wearing your mask now, bitch. And let me tell you, bitch, I'll do it again. <laughs> I hate going to the mechanic and this is exactly why I've stalled going I've stalled uh, sorry my simulation glitched there but I've been stalling getting the oil change for like 3 months now it's overdue, very long my car sounded like it was breaking down so I took it to the whatever oil change mechanic place but I just feel bad because every time I go there they keep offering me things that are like Oh, your brake pads need to be redone, your air filters, blah, blah, blah. Like, you've said that for the past, like, four times I've been there and I haven't done it. What makes you think I'm going to do it now? You know what I mean? But, like, I don't know. Just a lot of anxiety. I hate it so much. I know they want to take advantage of me. They keep telling me I need all these things. Then I feel bad. Then I actually do it. Then I waste all my money just because I don't want to invalidate their experience and their, like, recommendations. But, like, I, it's so hard going. This is why I don't go to the mechanic. This is why I wait until my car stops working and my battery dies or something. <sighs> Questions for the gays, but deep edition. Alright, I'm ready. Who was the hardest person for you to come out to? Definitely my uncle. What stereotype about gays do you hate the most? That we hit on every straight man. Are there still instances where you are terrified to come out to certain people? No, not example, anymore. example, mine is at work. Have you ever been personally called names to your face or behind your back because of your Definitely. Sexuality? All the time. Do you have internalized homophobia? I used to. And if so, are you doing anything to try to fix it? Just had to find some resources. How many mental illnesses do you suffer with? Just one. Are you going to therapy? I am. Do you know that you're loved? I do. I do now. You said no. I love you. I love so you too. So now you know. And finally, if you could change your sexuality and be straight, would you? No way telling me I got problems, and I'm like, well, what do you mean problems? I'm just trying to lose weight. But chicky nuggies are, like, bomb, so don't at me. Watching my boyfriend build whatever this is. I helped Taha. Look at him go. He yells at me here. It's really coming together now. He doesn't want my help, ha uh huh? It's done. Peep the Louboutins. What does my partner do to make me feel sexy? Tells me I'm handsome every day. He calls me daddy. Occasionally. <laughs> I definitely does it. I don't understand why women are sometimes attracted to gay guys. Like, they're so annoying and feminine. Hello, there's a perfectly good guy right here that you could be with. You know what? You're right. Thank you. I am a perfectly good guy. No, not about that. You suck ass. I mean about the fact that women are sometimes attracted to gay guys. I don't get it. It's almost as if women prefer a guy who's comfortable and confident with his masculinity, who isn't afraid to show his feminine side, and who treats them with kindness and respect. What do you mean? Well, most gay men are comfortable enough in themselves and who they are to wear what they want and act how they want. Most women find that much more attractive than an inconsiderate douche who only cares about himself and bullies other guys because he is so insecure in himself. I'm not insecure. Would you be weirded out by a guy wearing makeup? Duh, that shit's for girls. You're insecure. God, why do I have to work? I am sexy. I am sexy. Why am I working? What is this? Here we are. <laughs> oh, we started. Okay. I'm lost. No. Are you guys gonna stay down there all night? Okay, cool, no. Yeah, that's great. Loves me, he loves me not. No, yeah, I didn't think this through. Stop it! Yeah, I'm okay. No, yeah, I'm great. Thank you. On camera? Get over here, you little twerp! Get her! 
Sam, you go. Oh. Oh yeah, that's okay. She was a bitch anyway. Hi.